There are many traditions around the holiday season, all of which we enjoy. One of those traditions that we thoroughly enjoy is the third century singers. And here with us today, who are you folks now? It's good to see you, Pierre <laughs> Prots <laughs> and George, George Hello, Strunk. Strunk. It's Strunk. good to see yes, you. How are you guys doing? Good. Really? It's good. so good to see oh, you. Oh, happy to be here and yeah. thankful to be here. We appreciate you doing this for well, us. Well, certainly. Uh, we want to talk about this because it's coming up very soon. Uh, there's uh, a couple of uh, concerts you're going to be putting on. Mm -hmm. And uh, first of all, let's get, let's get a little background on third century in case somebody's new to the area and they don't know who the third century singers are. Who wants to tackle that one? I'll take that Okay, on. you've been doing this 25 <laughs> I've, years. I've been doing this almost 25 years now with the group, yes sir. Yeah. And uh, they started back in 1976 for the bicentennial celebration. Right. And had almost 100 singers, I think, that wow. year. People just wanted to get together and celebrate the, the country's birthday. And they had such a great time when it was over, they thought, we need to Stay together. Stay together yeah. and, and mm -hmm. come up with a new name. They were the Bicentennial Singers. Okay. And you just can't <laughs> carry that load forever <laughs> from year to year. That's so right. they, they, they thought about it, and uh, I believe it was George Johnson, who used to be with, with the, the News Argus, Argus sure. years ago, yeah. uh, came up with the Third Century Singers, figured okay. that that would be a name we could put to use for a good time. Mm -hmm and not have to change it. So With our country going into its third into century. Into its third exactly. century. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And so here we are now, 41 years later. And what do you do when, it, when it's not Christmas? Uh, you, I know you, you, you stay busy, you're singing, you're practicing all the time. So what do you do besides Christmas? Or, or do have, you do anything? We have spring concerts as well as yes, Christmas do. concerts. Yes, we do. And last spring's concerts were really dynamic because it was a huge review of Broadway. Ooh. It was yeah. wonderful. Show Cole tunes. Porter and Irving Cole Berlin. Porter, yes. yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. It wonderful. was just fabulous. And our audiences enjoyed it so much. We had some people that came back for all three concerts. Really? We sure did. So, um, and I don't know what um, our director, Dr. Carl Ashley, has planned for us for this spring, but that would be a hard act to follow, wouldn't it, George? I, he said something about this being an anniversary year for Leonard Bernstein. Oh. Oh, well, that's and a good so one. And so maybe a do a one. compilation of his works. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, depending on, you know, how much music we could find of his in of our his. library and, yeah. and how costly yeah. it would be to acquire mm -hmm. some new stuff. But mm -hmm. yeah. I think that would be definitely something that people would be attracted to. I think so too. Now when you say all three concerts, when you hold a concert, you usually have three. You, you do three Typically. nights. Mm -hmm. uh, one, uh, one or two at the First Baptist here in Goldsboro mm -hmm. and then one at the First Baptist in Mount Olive. Exactly. If I'm not yes, mistaken. That's true. Mm -hmm. okay. This year though we've cut it down to two. Have you? Okay. Our attendance has been really spotty at the Saturday evening performance. Well, that's we just have not so much competition in the city. <laughs> yeah, there's uh, a lot of competition, a lot of events, a lot of things and, going on, mm -hmm. and so much going on. So we decided that we would try to do just two concerts and and hope for real good attendance at both. Okay, let's see if we can get this on on screen here. That's uh, I'm sorry, Pierre. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Go ahead. <laughs> no, it's okay. We've got the Messiah coming up here, Handel's Messiah. Um, it was Handel, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah, George yes. Frederick. Yeah, George Frederick. <laughs> <laughs> but um, uh, this uh, will be at First Baptist Church in Goldsboro, Sunday, December 10th at 4 p.m., and then Tuesday, December 12th at 7 p.m. at First Baptist in Mount Olive on Chestnut Street. Mm. Messiah. Mm. That's, yes. a, that's a dynamic, that's, that's it is. strong, mm. strong piece. Mm -hmm. uh, and beautiful, beautiful, insp inspiring music indeed. based on the book of Isaiah, yeah. the birth of our Lord. Um, and it's going to be a wonderful concert. Yes, we, we, mm. we decided that uh, we would invite uh, the First Baptist Church Choir to join us. Oh, that's wonderful. And we've mm -hmm. reached out to other choirs and we have, uh, we, we should have thought ahead of time and put third century singers and friends, mm -hmm. uh, but we have singers from First Presbyterian, uh, not First Presbyterian, uh, Madison Avenue Baptist. Madison Avenue Baptist, mm -hmm. yeah. And uh, 
First African Baptist downtown. Oh, great! Out on Harris Street. Harris Street. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and they're doing actually doing a uh, Messiah concert uh, this coming Sunday at six o'clock. Okay. At First African Baptist on Harris Street, and uh, and. George and I are going to sing with that group too. Oh, yeah. So we're just oh, really that's great. Yeah, we've got four other third too. century singers involved in that. Mm -hmm. well, that's wonderful. And they will have a couple of their uh, choir singers coming to join us in concert too. Mm -hmm. So yeah, uh, I know I know even accomplished singers and choirs, uh, as accomplished as they are there's still, at times, challenges with certain pieces of music. What were the challenges with the Messiah? Well, it is a very complex mm -hmm. piece of music, and um, uh, I guess the runs. <laughs> the runs. <laughs> the runs. The, um, I mean, there, there are a lot of parts and pieces to it that yes. are difficult, but um, it's, it's just such a great feeling when you start to see it come together mm -hmm. and everybody's getting it and it's, it's just last night's rehearsal was wonderful. Mm. It was really so it's, good. It's really come together. People mm -hmm. were coming in when they should. Yeah, and yeah it, what seemed um, a daunting task to begin with for a lot of people, I mean, I think they must feel really, really good that they have accomplished, you know, learning this piece of music the way they have. Timing is, is key here. Mm -hmm. is, is yes. When you come in and you have to hit that post just right. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. Yes. And of course it helps to be able to sing as well. Well, and it helps to have a great director too. We do have a great director in Carl Ashley, a yes. very accomplished musician himself. And he and his wife Marie both are very vocally um, accomplished. They surely are. So we're happy to be under his direction. Yes. Okay. And so, he's an educator as well, so that mm -hmm. he brings that to the table, and, and we all learn a little something every season. Well, that's great. Mm -hmm. That's great. Yeah. So Sunday, December 10th at mm -hmm. 4 o'clock at First Baptist Church, Tuesday, December 12th at 7 p.m. at mm -hmm. First Baptist Church in Mount Olive. Mm -hmm. Now tell me about, again, the First, Bapt First African Baptist. Mm -hmm. uh, that is coming up Sunday? That is Sunday the... Third of third. December. This, this Sunday will be the third. Uh -huh. At six o'clock in the evening. Okay. Mm -hmm. right. We'll have a very accomplished um, collection of soloists for our performance mm -hmm. as well as an orchestra. Mm -hmm. And First African Baptist is going to have a really cool lineup of very accomplished uh, musicians also. Excellent. Yeah. All right. So. That is excellent. All right. And there's no admission charge. However, donations are accepted. True. Right. Yes, sir. Excellent. <laughs> so w how would someone find out more about this? Is there a connection, a contact? You have a Facebook page. We have a Facebook page, mm -hmm. or they could call one of the two of us. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you want to give your number? Sure. I don't yeah. mind. Okay. 919-394-1091. That's right. Or 919-778-8324. She called earlier and I didn't recognize the number. <laughs> and I said, who is this? <laughs> who is this really? <laughs> That's right. But anyway, yeah, I had left a message, but you were just, you were Johnny on the spot to get back in just touch. Just getting back in. Which is so true of you. Well, I, I don't like to leave things hanging on. Yeah, anyway. I appreciated that. Well, Pierre sure. Protz, thank you so much, dear. It's always thank a pleasure you. to see you. Thank you, you. Great Wayne. to see you. George Strunk, it's Wayne, good to see you, buddy. Good to see you again. Very good. Thank you so much. Third You're Century Singers. Third Century Singers. Thank We're you. We're excited about the Messiah. Mm -hmm.